It's a growth industry right now, pardon the pun. Mold is money. I just wish I wasn't so scared of finding it. The buffet line is clogging at Sector B. I repeat, Sector B is moving too slow. Oh, and uh, if you get lost in the maze, don't panic. Just stand still, wave your hands, and the uh, maze guard will find you. I'm supposed to install a DSL for a Lorelei Gilmore, is that you? Ribbons here? Return your ribbons here. Oh, my God. What the hell is that? I am the Minotaur. Why? Do you know what this is? Um, no. Damn. Hey, am I doing this right? What? Never mind. I'm not a school, Luke. No one's raising money for me. I saw the opportunity to enter the market at a lower price point, and I took it. Get your lunch at the Dragonfly. You have not eaten lunch till you've eaten lunch at the Dragonfly. Because I happen to be in possession of the finest estate ring collection in Connecticut. What the hell is going on here? Welcome to Kirk's. I'll be right with you. What is this? It's a diner, Luke. One sample per person, people. One sample only. Don't make me use the candy thermometer on you. In my official capacity as town sash presenter, I would like to present you with this sash, which I also happen to make in my official capacity as town sash maker. Well, I checked under the entire house. And? You have termites. What? Tens of thousands of them. Subterranean, dry wood, the whole gamut. Gross. Four of them crawled up my nose. Hi, Kirk. What can I do for you? I have a delivery for Suki. Oh, wow. Anything good? No, just some wedding photos. Great. Well, she stepped out for a minute, but I'll take them to her. I swear, I'll, I'll give them to her. The point is, oh. I think the pizza needs to be cheeseless. What? And possibly sauceless. Pete. The thing's a hazard, babe. Pete, did it ever occur to you that the problem may not be the pizza, maybe Kirk? Did not occur to me. What are you doing here? Trying to bag a whale. Kirk's in the real estate game now. Stop doing that. What? Referring to yourself as Kirk. That's Kirk's thing. Every realtor needs a thing. This is Kirk's thing. Hey, Luke, can you whip me up something in a hurry? What, Kirk? Hey, chocolate phosphate? OK, now what the hell is this? Why do you want a phosphate? Because nothing says refreshment like a phosphate. Hello? I have a gun! Chill out, Kirk. We're here for the movie. You were supposed to pay out front. You weren't out front. Luke, are you taking applications for jobs at your skateboard and bottle shop? Yeah, I'm interviewing people today, Kirk. Great. Shall I go home and change, or will casual suffice? I like the going home part. I don't understand. with flowers we ordered? Flowers we did not order. I'm just doing my job. Say that one more time and I'm going to punch your nose. It must be a mistake. There's no mistake. I did not order these flowers. It says that you have to be here to personally accept them. We have our soda shop, everybody. Yes. <laughs> Meeting dismissed. Taylor, is it too soon to talk about management opportunities? Where do you want the swans? Um, well, do you know where the pond is? Nope. I'm assuming that you're going to pay for the food that you've consumed on the premises. <laughs> So brusque. <laughs> and you are? I'm the new assistant manager here. Have you ever shot a wedding before? Actually, this would be my first official wedding gig, or photography gig for that matter. But believe me, I've got the eye, and my Nikon is state of the art. Well, I've got a Nikon, too. It's an N64 with 3D matrix metering, 35 to 210 zoom. What have you got? It's a Nikon. Uh, the cap is still on the lens, dear. Oh, thanks. Soup with garlands, gay and rosemary. You're gonna stay in character no matter what, huh? Tis hot, so proceed daintily. Now, for day, I would recommend something with a sunscreen. Rory has a classic peaches and cream complexion, and it would be a crime if when she got older, her face started to look like a cowboy. I couldn't agree more. I swear, they told me it would be self-explanatory. I just had to get in the main box, and in seconds, this thing would be disabled. They didn't tell me that I needed a key, or that if I didn't have a key, then I would be mildly electrocuted. If you'll just follow me, I would like to present you with my new line of one-of-a-kind mailboxes. Wow, they look very nice, Kirk. And whimsical. They say to the world, I'll take my mail with a smile. I developed what I believe to be the next great skincare product to sweep the nation. Hey there. A complete line of creams, balms, toning lotions, and cleansing liquids. I personally hid 300 eggs around the town square, and the kids had a blast hunting them down, except the Banyan boys, their bad seeds, going to hell, both of them. But the kids only found 241 of them. I am planning the Firelight Festival. Taylor left me in charge, and I have to make sure everything's perfect. Move, Roger.
I mean, these cards are agreements. It's an agreement between you and the Stars Hollow Video Store stating that you will take care of your card, that you will honor your card, that you'll be very, very nice to your card. I'll hang on to this, but as I said before, we just opened, so I'm not really looking to hire anybody right now. I am licensed to carry a gun, if that will help. What's with all the dogs, Kirk? Well, people in town saw how good I was with Lulu's dog that they asked me to watch theirs for a fee, of course. I offered you the first ride in Kirk's new Stars Hollow Petty Cab, and that is exactly what you're gonna get. Face. And then 30, and then 35, and then 40, and then 45, and then 50, until we find all 59 and take back the square! Yeah! We are happy to help you with all of your mailing and notarizing needs. I will need you to fill out your name and address, and then I will need a thumbprint. I know how it works, Kurt. Taylor paid me $20 to jump out of a plane for the grand opening. No! But I took a lesson. The guy said I was a natural at falling. How about if she says, doll, you've got the gams, but I've got a body in the trunk of my car. Why would she say that? Because she's a murderer. I took it upon myself to pull the town, and I think you're gonna be pretty happy with the results. We are? Jackson is solidly in the lead. We're on, boys. Excuse me. Where do you want it, sir? Close, dude. Really, really close. Roger Wilco, drop it and stack it, boys. Aren't you supposed to go through the mail before you get here? Some work that way. Personally, I think it takes the spontaneity out of the job. Need some help? Sorry, federal law prohibits it. Any chance you could go faster? Yeah, you got a girl's future in that sack of yours, Santa. Thank you for adding the Santa. What are you doing here? I'm assembling the bouquet garni. I thought you hired him. I did not hire him. I thought I might want to work on a kitchen staff someday, and I figured this was a good place to learn. Kirk, get out! Can I at least finish my shift? Sure you don't want to reconsider my offer? I've got a hairnet on me, so I can start immediately. Offer declined. Flower delivery. Oh, Kirk? Oh, I didn't know you worked for Grayson's. Oh, no, I don't work there. I'm volunteering. How noble. Yeah, I just thought it was time to give something back. Are you ready to rumble? Then let's get it on! Hope ye took much pleasure in Kajagoogoo. Methinks Oingo Boingo will soon make us an appearance. But first, please clear the floor for our happy couple. F. You don't work here? I thought I might like to go into hotel management someday, and I figured this was a good place to learn. You're aware that this is the first time I'm running the Winter Carnival? I am aware. I can't afford to have anything go wrong. I'm coming for you! Well, then my new line of bath and shower adhesive decals are for you. Huh. Yesterday, today, and tomorrow. Yesterday's retro designs in today's fashion colors with tomorrow's traction technology. Quickum souvenirs, I've got your bats, I've got your balls, I've got your foam fingers. Cherry, peach, chocolate, pumpkin, custard. Custard's fine. There's more. I know, but custard's fine. You don't want to hear the rest? I am really good with the custard. But they made me memorize 30 different flavors. Kirk? Yes? Custard is fine. You want ice cream with that? Are there different flavors? 32. Just the pie. All right, well, I've put wood in all the guest rooms and the living room, so all I have to do is store the rest of the cord you bought. OK, Michelle, I'll take you outside and show you where it goes. Outside? Do you really want to expose your wood to the elements? We'll get a tarp. The movie's all ready to go. OK, thanks, Kirk. I just need it back for the Weinstein retirement party. Mel Weinstein's a nut for John Hughes movies. The first one is Constabulary Road. Constabulary Road. It's a very nice name, classic. Very evocative of old time Stars Hollow. Yes, it's very nice, but Kirk, that's the exact name of Esther Wilkins Street. I mean, the exact name, <laughs> it's taken. I know. Apparently at one time there were several streets named Constabulary Road in Stars Hollow. Yeah, that would be incredibly confusing. Oh, it would be disaster. It was back then too. Mail was misdelivered, soldiers lost their way. It completely disoriented senior citizens. There was rioting, chaos, death, everyone hated it. May I interest you in a shirt? Oh, Kirk, you're not selling your laundry again, are you? No, these are part of my latest money-making endeavor. I'm going to print daily t-shirts featuring a humorous topical headline of something I witness around town. Neat. I got the idea when I read about something a man was doing in Portland. What was he doing? He was printing daily t-shirts featuring a humorous topical headline of something he witnessed around town. Green needles! Green needles!